Hey everybody, Bill Murphy here with MMORPG.com and we are going live with a little single player RPG love tonight because Final Fantasy XV finally launched on the PC. Uh, I have it on the PS4 and I decided not to finish it for multiple reasons. One being I always have some other game I have to play because it was, so it was easy to pull myself away. Uh, two being that I really, really wanted to wait for the PC version once it was uh, announced. Um, because it's the complete edition. It's got all the DLC. It's got you know improved 4K visuals and stuff like that. So let's um, let's get in there. I just started this earlier today. Uh, wasn't too far. I think level three. Basically, finished the first the first mission for uh, for Cindy. So we'll get going. Let me know if the in-game volume is too loud too. And I think I'm only playing at 1080p, just because the windowed version of Final Fantasy 15 on the PC seems to be um, a little strange. It does weird things. Oh man, it's such a good game. It's it's easily one of the best Final Fantasies ever, even though it's it's drastic. A drastic change for the series, but sometimes that's what these games need. I mean, uh, Assassin's Creed just did it too with with 15, really changed things up to uh, is it because of that I keep passing that? Let's make tracks. All right. Yeah. Let's. So let's go into graphics here, and we'll do um, frame rate 120 preset is the highest. Oh wow, I don't I could do this. Turn that on. Oh, something happened. Okay, we also went full screen a little bit there. Shadow libs. And display. We're at 1080, so let's go, let's up this sucker. We might have to change to 1440 at least. No, cool. It stayed the right size. Uh and V-Sync. It'll never go a higher than 120, but I don't think we're going to hit 120 anyway. Ooh, that looks good. If only you guys could see this. If the in-game volume is too loud, let me know. I'll turn things down. Performance will probably be hit for me a little bit because I'm streaming to several different channels, but as far as uh, performance goes for Final Fantasy XV on PC, it is buttery smooth. I mean, this is a fantastic port. There are some control issues if I have with the keyboard, uh, some menus and things like that that could use a mouse pointer that don't have Sometimes it. Sometimes I wonder if we'll ever see inside that beautiful car again. Sitting most of the day was pretty nice. Napping was even better. Let's pick up some food. So you can um you can actually just use E. It tell it tells you that mouse will pick things up, but you can also just use E as like an action key. It's an alternate one. So I thought we beat this sucker earlier. The game might have crashed on me. That's fine. Hey Andrew, hello, how are you? And that's one thing I'm worried about now is um is I did have a couple crashes when I was streaming off from my laptop. I was doing some test streams to Streamcraft, which is a new stream streaming platform. It doesn't it's not supported on XSplit yet, so I can't like stream to it. Um but we will be. We'll, we're on, we'll be on StreamCraft, too, because they're pretty rewarding. They seem to... They have no exclus, exclusivity clause, and yet they'll um, they'll give you money so far, just for bringing viewers in Our and getting sign-ups and stuff like that, like a dollar per it, person right? for signing up, huh. so pretty cool That's stuff. StreamCraft, yes, watch out for it. Of the mill breed. We best make quick work of it. All right. So that was the part where they talk about, hey, you can tell us to do things. Look at that hair. Look at that gnarly beard. What? Scared, big guy? You ought to be too. Are we dropping frames? You sure? It looks kind of jaggy for you guys, doesn't it? Doesn't look jaggy at all for me. Like, it's clear as can be. Nice one. But something funny's going on on the stream. You have to let me know if it looks messed up. Ready for round two. Bring it. Instructions. 
if it's looking a little jaggedy, I don't know. Because I'm, I'm seeing it on the stream. I'm looking. I'm looking at the camera, and it looks kind of uh, looks kind of messed up. Ring, <laughs> ring. But on my screen, on my on my uh, my stream, it looks fine. Hello. Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Okay. Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. Oh, while I got ya. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. Those of you guys who are who are actually watching, can you comment and um, let me know if, if the stream seems to be skipping good. for you? Or if it's actually garage. smooth? Gotcha. Just want to make sure that it's just the preview on XSplit that's messed up. So, some minerals here. Next behind the wheel. Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Sure and the janky camera there. is still a problem. Put me in the driver's seat. Good. Cuz I need the legroom in back. Yeah, the game video is choppy. I don't really understand why. What's up, Wild Arms? Yeah. And that's coming from both YouTube and uh, Twitch. So let's see here. I wonder why. Let's maybe do it. We'll go back to windowed version. Let me turn that off there. And we'll do a... Uh, Here, let's try. See, that looks better already, I think. Just by rebooting it that way. Yeah, that looks better. Maybe I just had to reload it. Yes, I. so did NVIDIA. NVIDIA's got a cool shadow play thing where it'll record moments for you. Um... I, which, I, which I thought is neat. Onward. Like, if you have a really good combat thing, it'll record it for you. Then you can share it. It's still kind of looking a little choppy-ish, but we'll just keep going. I might have not have updated my drivers, come to think of it. Birthday was great, Wild Arms. Thanks for asking, actually. I had a really good time. Um, went to a winery in, uh, in Dayton area. Let's see. Looking at my drivers now. We're going to find out. Check for updates. I think I've got the Final Fantasy 39101. Latest driver. I think so. Yep, have the latest. Okay. Well, let's just uh, let's just keep playing. Might be that I'm streaming it at 1080 for you too. Maybe you can't do that tonight. But it seems to be okay now. Alright, so we're going to go back and get the regalia. That is my really pimp-ass car that my dad gave me that I had to get fixed. It's rude to keep a girl waiting. You better apologize. What is that? Oh yeah, the bird. Said so what now? A live hurricane. <laughs> that thing's like... Half bird, half storm, half airship. You realize that's three halves. That would explain its size. <laughs> awesome in every sense. We will later see that bird again. Yeah, this game is no joke in terms of uh, in terms of power needed to really to really run well. Here we go. So how many of you guys actually played Final Fantasy XV on the PS4 or the Xbox when it was out earlier? And how many of you didn't because you're not a console gamer, so you've been hoping and waiting for this version?
Yeah, I played quite a bit of it on the PS4, but I, I stopped at... Oh, jeez. I think when they were infiltrating the base or oh, infiltrating the city again yeah. of Insomnia, which you guys will see. That might have been when I stopped and I said, you know what, I'm going to wait. Plenty of other things that I need to play for work, and I know it's coming out to the PC eventually, so... And I'm glad I waited. So this is one of the many outposts. We're here. You want to go check it out? What is it? <laughs> what do you want to check out? <laughs> Did I do that? Prompto wants us to check something out. <laughs> Andrew, I, I kind of I kind of understand that, but I think that the the series needs to have different kinds of games. I mean, if you think about like Final it Fantasy XIV, it's days, very yeah. traditional Doesn't Final matter. Fantasy. It's just an MMO. Good. Uh, whereas 15 is, is something very different, you know, it's like a really big departure for the series, and that's a good thing sometimes. I do think that one day we might see another um, turn-based Final Fantasy, but it's going to be a while. It has to be in vogue. Right now, if you want a turn-based Final Fantasy, yeah, you're going to have to play hot. one of those um, lose the RPG Factory games. Sorry, but I'll be curious way. to see what Final Fantasy 16 is whenever hurting. that gets announced. She's almost too pretty for the road. She's back. We should all get a picture with her. That is Cindy, the famous Final Fantasy Sid's granddaughter, uh, who just happens to be a stone cold fox, of course. <laughs> who Prompto, the little blonde haired guy, is in love with. All the more reason to ride with care. Oh, and before I forget. Yeah, the Final Fantasy VII remake is going to be something special. It's going to play like this, though, so purists of Final Fantasy VII won't like that. Um, it's going to be action oriented and it's built on the Unreal no. Engine, Unreal 4. Perfect. Thought you'd say yes. So I already put it in the trunk. There should be a motel on your way to Galden. If y'all wouldn't mind giving that to the owner, that would be swell. All right. Grandpa like grandkid. Have you guys played the Final well, Fantasy 15 Pocket right Edition the on the mobile phones? Would you the one that's like for a little surprisingly no really good. good. That's true. You might be right about that, Marcos. He might not be the only one in love with Cindy. Uh, let's leave it to Ignis. Driving is boring sure in this game because you got to stay on the road. I see. Then allow me to take the wheel. Yeah, that part's kind of annoying. That's just a straight-up cash grab from them. Hopefully it comes with lots of extra content and stuff, because Final Fantasy VII was a massive game, but... Breaking it up into three sounds like when they put The Hobbit into three games. It was unnecessary. <laughs> All right, so this guy... We don't really need to talk to any of these people. Eh, screw it. Let's just get in the car. That thing is pretty... Okay. Uh, auto. Quest location. I feel like we did that. Maybe I didn't. Eh. If it's one minute away, let's let's do this quest. What is it? Q. Nope. Nope. There we go. That's what I was looking for. That's the one we're tracking. Yeah, it automatically drives. Like, auto-drive is like, uh, it's like slow travel. There are some, some fast travel options later, but um, the game's like driving is boring. You don't really you drive, so or you have to stay common. on the road. It's more of an Who's excuse to listen to people talk and lady. progress their relationship. When all this is over, I'm going to visit her in Hammerhead. Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. <sighs> right, so we got to kill these guys. I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, 
Right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! I <laughs> uh, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own ways. Please. That was late. Alright, now we go back here and we get ourselves our little quests. Quest completion. These are like hunts. Every um, every little town has hunt boards, basically. Um, which are just like any other Final Fantasy game that's had these monster hunts in them. You can do them for quest rewards and stuff like that. I mean, this, this is a big game, too. If you rush through the story, you can probably beat it in about 20 to 30 hours. But, I mean, most people take their time and you're talking like... 80 to 100 hours. Whoa. Real nice here. Yeah. And there are so many cool little features in this game, too. Like, uh, I think it's Alt F3? Oh, does that have to be full screen? Maybe it's Alt F2? I don't know. Yeah, you can do, um, you can do Ansel. Ansel photography, which is always nice. Let's get a picture of our pretty boy. See? There's Prompto. Take a snapshot in Ansel. But um, it, he'll take his own photos, too. Prompto takes his own photos, and then every time you camp, you can review those photos and see what they did. Like, uh, it, It's just really cool. And then uh, Ignis actually cooks, and big old... Uh, What's his face? Big old Gladiolus. He'll actually uh, he he does sets up the camp and stuff like that. The install's massive. It's about seventy five gigs to download uh, because oh, it has four K textures. I don't think you need to nice do four K textures here. though. It's not not necessary. See one hunt done. There are other hunts here, but we're gonna. I can tell you all about the area. Get on with it and go to the car. And do our little drive here. Bye, Cindy. Okay. Auto drive to the quest location. The errant prince. Everything in order. Yep. See, you can customize this car too. Like right now, it's I think it's a default purple. I always thought it was like default black, but it sure looks purple. Um, you can customize the color, logos, different things all over it, and, and you unlock them as you play. Um, and you can take control of driving, but it's really just you have to stick to the road. It's very, very strict. You can't go off roading at like GTA or something. And the driving has all of, like, the greatest hits of the Final Fantasy soundtrack you can listen to also. See, like... There we go. From the Kingsglaive soundtrack. Oh yeah, and you do run out of gas, and if that happens, you actually do have to get out and push the car, or go get gas. <laughs> That's kind of fun. They're not having any interesting conversations this time. Because we're not going too far. There we go. This is the package we have to drop off for Cindy. And another. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Potions. Nice. 
You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? <laughs> You all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, thank you kindly. We'll dig it out of the trunk, so you all just sit tight. Oh, this dog. It's pretty sweet, too. He's got the best hair. He's such a good boy. <laughs> Bringing us stuff. Had a boy. A dog can really track a scent. Suddenly knows how to find us. How do you always know, boy? Just a sec. Some memories here about Lady Luna Freya. That's who he is going to get married to to keep the peace and help defend the, the kingdom from the empire. From. Oh, yeah. It doesn't so go awesome. according to plan. Nice Chuck Taylor's knocked. That's pretty great. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure. That's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. They've been like long distance pen pals ever since. They barely know each other, but they are betrothed. Finally going to see you after all these years. Here we go. All right, all right, all right. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> you don't say. <laughs> Prompto is, uh... Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden. Annoying, but also, I love him. <laughs> Hold on a sec, sir. I found an envelope addressed to Meldasio inside the package. Meldasio. The Hunter HQ? Yes, sir. The head hunter ought to be around here somewhere. Mind making one more delivery? What do you say, Noct? Might as well while we're in the good. neighborhood. He's actually right over here. 1.49 miles. I think we can take the car over there. Make it easy. Oh, no, we can't. Okay. It's not too far of a run. You can rent chocobos. Yup. Oh, that's right. I, you have to unlock it. <laughs> can't rent them right away. Hop over the wall. Ugh. Let's go wandering down the road. So, uh, you thinking to fairy tale Lady Lunafreya back to the Crown City? Nah, let me. <laughs> Just dawned on me. I am not going to the right place. For us to happily ever after. Wow. He's, so uh, he was right around the corner. Tying the knot, dude. How does it feel now that it's finally happening? Fine, I guess. Ah, uh, come on. You can't fool me. Any guy would be over the moon to marry her. No big deal. Yeah, whatever. Nope. I like how they're all stuck, too. This is an Assassin's Creed, apparently. They'll catch up. <laughs> there he is. I don't know why I forgot that. Well, look who it is. I really owe you boys one. Make That's that Dave. <laughs> Can't seem to catch a break. Dave's my dude. But being a hunter's tough. Now looks like they found another one. Wait, uh... Found another what? Tag. Us hunters keep them on our person at all times as identification. What? In case you forget who you are? More like so no one else forgets who they were. 
Bingo. Lead a life of danger. Sometimes these tags are the only things that make it back in one piece. It's our job to deliver them to the families of the fallen. As it were, I came out here to do just that. <sighs> if y'all happen to find any tags lying around out there, would you do me a favor and send them my way? Yeah, sure. Okay. Where it is, somebody spotted a tag around these parts. Try asking the local tipster. He'll point you in the right direction. Those tags are heavy stuff. They certainly carry emotional weight. We'd best find and return them. Let's and gather our intel. Families peace of mind. Let's start by following up on that hot tip. Welcome to the crow's nest. What would you like? Happy to tell you about the area. Thanks, man. Bloop, bloop. Now we can know where the dog tag is. Makes it easier. Have a look at the menu. Let's see. Oh, that was like all my money. I'll bring that right out. <laughs> Oops. We're Look gonna pay stomach. attention. I gotta camp soon too. Get these guys to level up a little. I can make this a camp. He can make us his own. These are some pretty tough customers. We'll take that one. That's great. Okay, Good luck there to we you. go. Uh, Jordan Crass on YouTube, man, this thing runs beautifully on PC. I don't know how luck, well optimized it is for every system, but uh, for mine, I'm, I'm having just a fantastic time. All right, so those guys are 0.27 miles away. It's not too far. We'll hunt down these guys. Uh, I don't think I'm high enough level to, but we'll give it a shot. It's also going to be nighttime soon, which is when I can take out those uh, goblins. forward. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> yep, sorry. Mouse wheel scrolls through your weapons and sometimes you, that happens. <laughs> so these guys actually slay the hunters and we're gonna we're gonna take them out. Earn back some of the money I just spent on food. I didn't see a treasure. Oh, there yeah. it is. Could be something good over here. go. Green choker. Oh, look at all this stuff. Andrew, really? Yeah, probably. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if the amount of RPGs I've played is you know, ridiculous. <laughs> Look at all this. Look at all these outfits. This part of the DLC. Heck yeah. <laughs> That's very festive. I could also just wear a Magitek exosuit and look ridiculous. Like a mag. I just noticed that. <laughs> okay, well, the, um, the Prince's fatigues still look the best.
Interesting. The magical. Oh, that's cool. The ring of resistance. That's kind of nice. Well, anyway, let's get out of here. We'll worry about that stuff later. Rather sultry. Yeah. I didn't expect all those like little little goodies. Yeah, all the DLC like episode Gladio, episode Ignis, and episode Prompto, already part of the Windows Edition. You don't have to buy them extra. And so is the um, Comrades DLC, which is the multiplayer mode. There are these motherfuckers. That's. I don't know if I can actually take them out, but we're gonna try. I don't think I'm high enough level. What's the worst that can happen? I die. We're in the money. Whoa. Try to hit him from behind. Wanna team up? Stay close. Guys. Just gonna try to. So that's good. Go. Ouch. Get Get the Rush nice. Now it's time to go to town. Agnes! Nailed it! Love that move. Chase him down. Knock his ass over. I'm level three to level ten, <laughs> but I'm not. I'm, doing, I'm not doing too bad. They're almost dead. Mind if I do? Nicely done. One more. I'm impressed. It's nothing. Pronto. Watch out. Oh, the camera. The camera, the camera. Oh, it's because I've got that on. Nicely done. All right, boys, we're in the home stretch. Don't go dying on me now. You're one to talk. All right, we report back to the tipster and we get ourselves some money. Not too shabby. It's almost bedtime. <laughs> Not for me, for them. Can't wait till I get those chocobos. Another one we could do now. 
Yeah, that's what I saw. I heard Chocobo's getting drift now. That was the tr Chocobo drifting? That was in the console version too, right? We'll just go to Golden Key next. Not worry about the side hunt right now. Keep progressing the story, try to finish chapter Man, one. It's hot. Then lose the jacket. <laughs> I could too. But I'm like, nah, I, I, I look too good. Oh. I like this one here. <sighs> I'm done. Yeah, broke a few bones in there. Ready or not? There's more. <laughs> oh, love the lighting. I knew he was going to take that picture. You do stuff like that in the game, and Prompto will use it as an opportunity to take a photo. Welcome. Welcome back. Welcome back. There we go. Made back that money. You want something to eat? Nope. Be careful. What I could use is an app, and you can actually play these games too. Let's go sit in our mo sleep in our motel. I don't think we get to do any camping, but we can level up. And then in the morning, we'll head to Golden Key. Oh, customer. Ooh, customer. Sure. Let's call it a day. Soft beds, baby. Oh, I got sixty nine AP, too. Prompto leveled up. That is an awesome picture. Uh, save that one. Hey, isn't that... Isn't what what? Just my imagination. What the hell's he talking about? Damn, this is a really good shot. <laughs> I made sure I got the regalia's good side. Pupper. Oh, that's a terrible shot of that. <laughs> Damn it, Prompto, you had one job, man. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll keep that one, too. Got some serious AP to use here. Get that combat up there. These timed quests. Oh, chapter three and onward. These are like uh, online quests. Interesting. Yeah, man. You, gas doesn't cost a lot in uh, in this fake world. <laughs> All right. So it's not nighttime anymore. So we can't do that right now. We'll worry about that later. We'll do the errand, Prince. Everything in order. Yep. All right.
Whoa, that guy was just flying. Where's the where's the party, man? For our next story, Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace, nor the pride I take in my betrothal playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages, as you always have, and I shall continue to bless you all. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming days. Please be advised that during this Prompto, time stop staring at me, man. as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And Noctier likes the idea. <sighs> What's that? I do? Buzz off. <laughs> Such a moody teenager. Almost there. Only to get torn away because the boats are shut down. Hey! I see the sea! I see it too. That's Golden Key. Kinda wanna go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. Nobody goes hey, to Golden King, what's for an up? island though. Uh, you know, I am sadly back, not partaking in Rift Prime. I'll I have too much going on. Right. I can't really it's focus on enjoying it a lot. So sounds great. Um, so I won't be doing it, to. but I'm I'm excited for those who are. We actually have a whole whole guild that's going to be uh, fo on our Discord and everything like that. You doing Rift Prime? Everybody's pretty pumped about it, so should be sweet. Don't you love how perfectly he parks without even looking back? We Ignis is the man. Supply of curatives. Gotcha. Yes, a supply of curatives. Plus, we have to refuel. Huh? Stay a while and listen. <clears throat> Tank is now full. Let's see, actually, what kind of weapons this guy has. Take a look at our wares. Ding dong. Broadsword. Attack forty-two. Current attack is. It actually goes up higher. Hmm. War sword. Avengers. Oh yeah, those are actually nice. So let's, uh, let's get one of those. Let's get two of those. Pleasure doing business. Okay. And uh, huh. prompto. Ooh. We'll get one. I'll see you later. Alright. Noctis can get his engine blade replaced with, uh. Wait, Ragnarok? Uh, yeah. Didn't expect that. What? 
They really put some good beginner stuff in here. Yeah, man. Okay. And Ignis, what do you got? The Mage Mashers. See? Oh, <laughs> poor Prompto. Now, in the mobile version, in the pocket edition, this is a much shorter dock, thank god. This is, this is just the longest dock ever. Hmm. It's nice to not have to kill anything. There, I found the sprint key. The letter V. Welcome to Golden Key. You're out of luck, are we? The boats bring you here. What about them? Well, they'll not take you forth. And what's your story? I'm an impatient traveler, ready to turn ship. The ceasefire's getting us nowhere. <laughs> what's this? Some sort of souvenir? <gasps> they make those? What? No. Consider it your allowance. Huh? Yeah. And who's allowing us? Who's allowing us? A man of no consequence. Oh, shit, Coolest right. villain ever. Oh. Oh. All right. You believe what that guy said about the port being closed? I'm skeptical, but I won't discount the possibility. I say we go check it out for ourselves. Always more food to eat. Sources, the Empire. Whose voice just does not fit him. Any vessels leave the At all. Pisha. Real shame if you were late to your own wedding. Hey, Ray wise Prince guy, Marcus. yes? Name's Dino, by the way. Name's Pleasure. Dino. The Crown Prince of Lucis bounty hunting in his fancy car. Surely you didn't think it'd go unnoticed. At least not by this reporter. Lucky for you, this reporter has integrity. If you want to remain incognito, I'll respect your wish. In exchange for a favor. <laughs> Oh, dear lord. Okay, listen to him. Yeah. He wants us to go get some stuff you want? for him. Jules. Hey, I know you'd come around. Let me see your map. Mark where you need to go on your map. All you gotta do is find me some rough gemstones. Like this one. Do this, and your ship will come in. Don't, and the papers will run you out of town. Capiche? Capiche? There's a, apparently the Italian mafia slash newsmen. I'm just on display now. Fourth. Now that's a meal. 
police really got your number, Knox. Huh. Not like we made much effort to keep it secret. Even if we had, the press always finds a way. We needn't befriend him, but we'd best not make him our enemy. Cat. Who wants a fish? Something we're not gonna do right now. Pretty sure we can actually. Um. Feels nice here take the car there. So let's try that. Or at least most of the way. There we go. Everything in order. Yep. So remember that big bird that flew overhead, so we'll get to uh, get to meet that again. Should be a nice change of pace. mining stuff. Ah! Whoops. OMG. Oh, we're supposed to get near that thing. Goodness. Pipe down before you wake it up. bird it has wings on its head. Oh, it stopped on me. Oh, we made it out alive. Barely. We got I seriously thought we were at journey's end. But that feat was fit for a king. Indeed. I love that that was something that was considered a fight. I'll take it. We.
Let's see. Um, we can do back to the quest location. We still gotta do the hunter thing too. It's a nice little side quest. <clears throat> Here we are. <sighs> we made it. To Dino. Is this place amazing or what? The breeze is quite refreshing. Didn't think I'd enjoy the seaside this much. Well, it sounds like it's made a good first impression. <laughs> Welcome to Golden Key. You gotta give. I love, I love how the, when you walk out of the sun, things get dark because your eyes actually have to adjust. That's a great little, great little touch. Um, but I, I love that uh, the animations in this game, they're just phenomenal. Very natural with a lot of weight to them. Here you go, Dino. Nice work, kid. Sorry for giving you such a hard time. Joe I Pesci. just had to get my hands on this, even if it meant blackmail. You understand, don't you? You see, I'm a reporter by day and an amateur jeweler by night. This elusive little beauty is going to become a masterpiece. <laughs> an Make amateur jeweler. You. I'll share a little scoop. That special coin you got? It commemorates the Oracle's ascension. That guy was tossing them out to everyone. Must have picked them up back in Niflheim. And speaking of freebies, here's one for me. Come back if you want to buy more. I doubt a souvenir like that could make its way into the hands of an ordinary citizen. Oh well, it's our pocket. Windows Explorer now. just reset Let's on me. Surprise the history and book of After this time. crash. Huh. As promised, I'm in the process of securing your ferry tickets right now. Talk to my belly button you, man. I'm a man of integrity. Talk to it. Should be smooth sailing from here. So let me know when you're ready to ship out. I admit I didn't expect Dino to secure us a ship. You guys ready to set sail? Yeah, let's go for it. Already? The ship won't arrive till tomorrow. How about you find a place to spend the night? Okay. Oh, it's a yawn. There we go. It's kind of early, isn't it? Nah, it's cool. Golden key. Gladiolus up to level two. He's a remedy retriever. Let's see. Pretty nice picture, actually. That douche nozzle. That's a good one. No, not that one. As we saw in the movie Kingsclave, bad shit goes down. The Empire takes over Insomnia. While you're just trying to go marry your lady love. I 
movie was fantastic, by the way. People that don't know Final Fantasy or don't care about it, maybe not like it, but as a prelude, as like an opening chapter, yeah, Kingslave rocked. This is, these are all scenes from Kingsclave. I kind of thought that they should have included Kingsclave as part of the Final Edition, too. Uh, yeah. King dead. That guy had match attack armor. Which is never a good thing. Meanwhile, I was sleeping in a beautiful hotel on the ocean. Hey, uh, morning. Where's Specs? Should be back any minute now. What's that look for? It's in all the papers. What is? Insomnia... false. What? Is this your idea of a joke? I need you to calm down so I can explain. I'm as calm as I'm gonna get! There was an attack. The Imperial Army has taken the Crown City. As Treaty Room tempers flared, blast lit the night sky. When the smoke about the Citadel had cleared, the King was found dead. No, wait. Hold on. We had no way of knowing. What? Knowing what? That the signing was last night. That insomnia... But the wedding! Altitia! I know. That was the plan. Yet the reports of the invasion are all the same. How could every headline in the Kingdom be wrong? If only. <sighs> what else do we know? Well, then we can't be sure until we see it with our own eyes. And that means we go back to insomnia. It might not be safe for us there. It might not be safe for us here. Turn Sorry, back. A moment. <clears throat> the king is not to his dad. They weren't very close, but. Pretty sure he's still pissed. Yeah. Oh no, I did get past when they... Yeah, I got past this part too. I can't remember how far I got on the PS4. tired guys so I'm not sure how much longer I'm gonna get to, be, to keep streaming but I do appreciate the fact that you all have stopped by and chatted with me and enjoyed some Final Fantasy 15 with me um, I'll be back Thursday tonight uh, if you want to watch more Final Fantasy 15 Brandon Wolf on his own channel uh, that's David Holmes one of our writers at MMORPG and Game Space he's gonna be over at the Brandon Wolf channel uh, Wolf with an E at the end and you'll be able to watch him there. He'll be playing this very same game. Oh, that's not good. See that? That's an Empire ship. Look at the size of those things. Imperial <laughs> dreadnoughts. They transport soldiers, namely the Magitek infantry. The robots? Mass-produced humanoid weapons of warfare, mm -hmm. to be more precise. Doesn't look like they'll be signing that peace treaty. Probably not. Probably not. Up ahead. <laughs> They've set up an inspection point. If the road ahead's blocked, then we find a way around.
Let's make a detour. There ought to be a decent vantage point up ahead. Let's save this sucker and uh, get as far as we can, I guess. Oh no, not not here. There, save the checkpoint. There they are. I want to take them out. Oh yeah, those scrap heaps are gonna wish they had a treaty to protect it. Time to rest. We should seek a vantage point. The hill. Humanoid soldiers, soulless, lustless. Right here. Oh. As the ceasefire discussions between the two nations, all provisional terms have been suspended in light of recent developments. Moreover, in the wake of the news of King Regis' death, we have now received word that Crown Prince bad for the King. And the Oracle Luna Freya have also been pronounced uh -huh. dead. Keep it on. Oh. <laughs> Don't bother. What's going on? Where are you? Outside the city. With no way back in. Makes sense. <sighs> makes sense? Are you serious? What about any of this makes sense? The news just told me I'm dead. Along with my father and Luna. Listen, I'm heading out to Hammerhead. <sighs> Core's the man, too, Not by the, the way. You might recognize his voice. <laughs> He don't die, Bob. Sorry. Yeah, that's a bummer.
Well, guys, we made it through Chapter 1. That was my main goal, actually, was to get through Chapter 1 tonight. Um, and then go to bed, <laughs> because I'm friggin' beat. We have a, a five-year-old and a two-year-old in this house. Uh, the two-year-old seems to be wanting to wake up every morning around 4 a.m., no matter what. And uh, then he wakes up the five-year-old. Roll the level, Dame. Hey, Dame, what's up? Um, absolutely love Final Fantasy XV. I don't think I told you, but I did play some of it on PS4. I can't remember how far I got, but a decent chunk in, a few chapters in. Um, I've been waiting for this PC version, just because that's my preferred platform. And this lady just keeps her eyes closed at all times. Hey, Lordicon, no problem, man. I really enjoy streaming. I wish I could do it more often. But Tuesdays and Thursdays are pretty much my time. So uh, always look out for me Tuesday and Thursday night around 9 or 10 p.m. for a couple hours. The Crown's Guard is still active. I wouldn't count on it. Can I save it? No. Not with the marshal. We'll let this stuff finish until we get another free roaming how period. Are in the city. There should be reports before. Yeah, something this big can't go ignored. And what about us? What do we do? We make for Hammerhead now, and figure the rest out later. Pretty much. And got then... a message from my sister. She's with refugees bound for Lestalem. We're gonna go to Lestalem. Well, at least Iris is okay. Yeah, that past Lestalem. Doesn't sound like everyone I else remember is that. So lucky, though. But yeah, there's, there's actually quite a bit of this game that I don't remember, which is funny because it was only a year ago, but I didn't finish it, so I guess that's a good thing. I unlock the chocobos. I don't remember. Far enough to know that I loved the game, but not far enough to make this be tedious when I'm playing through it again. Hey. Glad y'all made it. No weather for driving, that's for sure. Oh, thanks. Where's Cor? Uh, left to see the business. And left y'all a message with Paw Paw. Yeah? Boss ain't sat still one second since he heard y'all. There we go. Save. Overridden. We made it to chapter two. I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go get some sleep before I have to be back up in... Five hours? Five? Five and a half? Because that's my life. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, uh, StreamCraft now. Um, pretty much everywhere you can follow us, even on Instagram, although we barely use it. Uh, MMORPGcom without the dot. And do visit our brand new sister site, Gamespace.com. That covers everything not related to MMOs. Uh, and RPGs, so all indie games, Switch games, console games, game movies, game comics, all that kind of good stuff. So head on over there, too. Don't forget to follow us on those channels at Gamespace.com, uh, without the dot, as well. Thanks, guys. Uh, really enjoyed this, and I hope you guys are looking forward to more streams. If you want to know more about Final Fantasy XV on PC, head over to Branded Wolf's channel. That's twitch.tv slash Branded Wolf with an E at the end. And he'll, uh, he'll be playing it for a couple hours tonight, too. So thanks a lot, guys. Have a good night.